This field was receded in 2016. Um, it was put with um, a grassy mix of clover and perennial ryegrass. Now, as you can see, there's a lovely cover here. There's a huge amount of clover and there's a good uh, perennial ryegrass cover in it. The only issue that you can see is there is quite a few docks here as well. This is, this is a mature dock and this is what's below ground in the docks that you're seeing here. And these tap roots here can be up to a meter long in cases, if they're an older, if they're left over a couple of years. And what often we do is we go out to these in a silage field or in a field like this and you'll spray them. But what you're trying to do is you're trying to kill this entire root that could be a meter below the ground. And usually your spray won't go down that far and won't kill them. So what will happen is you'll kill the top growth, it'll die back for a year or two, and then your dock will grow back again from the root that was never killed. So the only way you're really going to kill these docks is through receding. The next thing then, I suppose, there's kind of two sides to this in terms of keeping, keeping the dock out of that fresh sward. So the first one is your roundup, you kill the mature dock, but the second one is your, your post-emergent spray. So six to eight weeks after you've set your reseed and it's grown for six to eight weeks, then you need to go in with your post-emergent spray. So you walk your reseed five or six weeks after and you see docks coming back up again and you say, oh, my roundup never worked. But they're actually a different dock to the dock that you sprayed off. So if you see here all these little seeds, a dock is going to produce about 50 or 60,000 of these every year and they are falling on the ground and spreading back into the soil. And what happens is these seeds can lay dormant in your soil for up to 50 years. And what, when you go then and till the ground, your moisture, uh, your sun, your temperature will, will, will allow these to germinate. So once the dock, the seedling dock, is the size of a two euro coin, you need to go in with your post-emergent spray and kill that off at that stage. So what you're doing then is you're, you're stopping the cycle. You have the old dock kilt and you have the new dock kilt and you'll have a clean pasture then. There'll be no seeds coming through. 